Well, this is uh, November Oscar to Charlie Whiskey with a um, quick review here of uh, a Logitech um, game controller that I thought I could use to uh, help me control my uh, SDR, SDR Play in this case. So I have my SDR Play switched to SDR uh, Uno and it's all up and running uh, as you can see. And um, I know these programs offer a bunch of different uh, keyboard shortcuts. Now, um, SDR Uno is not particularly rich in keyboard shortcuts. There are other programs that offer more, but I thought I would uh, start with uh, this one. So it's up and running. My antenna is not all that great. It, 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 I am receiving a, a few signals. But um, what do we do with these uh, keyboard shortcuts? Uh, let's see. Uh, the game controller is a generic game controller. What it does, it has a bunch of buttons and most of the time the manufacturer will give you a piece of software that you can uh, download and then you can program each individual uh, movement or click that, that is on this uh, game controller. There, there are buttons up here, up here on the left, on the right, uh, these go up and down uh, in different axes and of course they're very helpful for uh, different uh, for different games and gamers use them all the time. Of course, this is just a cheap uh, uh, Logitech one. There are some that are real, real, a lot fancier than this one. Uh, this one also is a uh, plug, plug in via USB. Uh, there are a number of ones that are Bluetooth uh, enabled, that are wireless enabled, all kinds of different combinations. So I took this one. These cost about $15 on the internet. And um, I downloaded the software for it and um, plugged it in, uh, started my SDR Uno, which as you can see uh, right now is up and running. And um, this is the 40 meter band. And uh, I could be, I don't have to be in front of my um, computer here. Uh, I programmed this button, for example, with up and down frequency. And it's different, difficult to um, video it and show it, but basically, um, all, the, all, all I do is move the controller uh, left and right and it will tune and I have up and down and uh, here's an example here uh, I'm on uh, 7133 and I programmed a couple of other buttons I programmed these four buttons to be my different modes this is uh, AM, lower sideband, upper sideband, uh, CW and I also have two FM modes programmed into these buttons up there. I don't use those as frequently. But here we are, for example, in uh, lower side band. And uh, as you can see, this is uh, amplitude modulation, lower side band, upper side band, CW, and back to lower side band. This is what it looks on the on the software itself. AM, lower side band, upper side band, uh, CW. Now I wish a lot more uh, options were programmable, such as the bandwidth, the tuning, the tuning step, for example, it has to be pre-programmed. And there's a few quirks that uh, don't make it ideal for SDR Uno. But uh, it may be something that you want to um, explore. The reason being, you can put up your SDR Uno on a large external monitor, for example, and uh, have one of these either wired or wireless and use it to control, um, to control your SDR Uno. Or you can lose it, look at the other pieces of software that uh, are very similar and I will uh, review a couple of those as well uh, and uh, program them and just go up and down and, and, and sideways and uh, do a few of those uh, shortcuts. So this is what I wanted to share today. Uh, thank you for um, checking uh, this out just so you get, a, get an idea of what the, this is the um, control screen for this particular uh, game controller. If you get other ones, they will have something like that that lets you program different keystrokes to different keys. Uh, there are also some, uh, some of the fancier, a fancier mouse would also give you that ability. 
Uh, a gaming mouse, for example, comes with a bunch of different options. Uh, there's, there's a large, large number of external controllers, such as game controllers and other controllers that are used by, uh, they're used by DJs, they're used by gamers they are, and, and whatnot. And some of them also have rotatable knobs that, that are pretty, that work very well with the software. So that's just something to explore. This is an example of a simple one. Uh, Logitech, very cheap. Uh, you can find it anywhere. Uh, and it gives you an idea of what you can do. And from there, you have to decide if it's something you want to explore and get something fancier than that. So uh, thanks again. I'll play with it uh, a little bit. And then uh, try some other software as well. And that's because... Uh, some other programs offer a lot more shortcuts uh, via, the, via the key programmable shortcuts than uh, SDR Uno. So thanks again for watching. This is uh, Ivan, November Oscar 2, Charlie Whiskey.